Chelsea versus Everton at Wheatsheaf Park. The Londoners could win their first title with a game to spare against the already relegated Toffees. And as a statement of intent, this was about as convincing as it gets. Emma Hayes side in front after just 38 seconds. Rachel Williams, the scorer. And it should have been 2-0 with less than seven minutes on the clock. Gabby George handling in the box. A cast iron penalty. Upstep Yuki Ajimi, but the Japanese was thwarted by the excellence of Rachel Brown Finnis in the Everton goal. But it didn't derail the Chelsea juggernaut for long because before the quarter hour they did score again. The speedy Aluko given the freedom of Staines to race through and produce an exemplary finish. At that stage, it was looking like a potential cricket score. An Everton fight back just wasn't in the script. But that's what happened. First, Lucy Whip took advantage of Laura Bassett's poor back pass to calmly make it 2-1. Before Nikita Paris's chip levelled the match just past the half hour. Maybe it was the realisation they were so close to the title that it affected the home side. Either way, they now had a real battle on their hands. Everton, though, have yet to win a league match all season. They were only level for four minutes. Once again, Aluko was the creator. Williams, again, the beneficiary. And it got even better for the Londoners when they scored again just before the break. Jackie Gronan with the assist this time. Aluko's second of the game, 4-2, after an extraordinary 45 minutes of football. Compared to that, the second half was always going to be an anti-climax, but Chelsea sealed the deal eight minutes from the end through Hannah Blundell. 5-2 the final score, and if they beat Manchester City next weekend, they'll be champions.